Today, Central Coast Now brings you Templeton Welcomes You. A visit to Templeton will give you the feeling that you have been transported back in time. A time when you could safely wander the boardwalks while eating an ice cream cone, sampling homemade chocolates, having a glass of local wine, dining on culinary delights, shopping at little boutiques, and best of all, spending time with the family. Here you will find the local citizens greeting you as you pass by. You will discover a town that is alive with history of times long since gone. As you wander on Main Street in Templeton, you will be able to step inside historic buildings that are part of the foundation of Templeton and an intrinsic part of its heritage. Step back in time to the fall of 1886 when C.H. Phillips of the West Coast Land Company sent R.R. Harris out to survey 160 acres of Paso Robles bordering on the Salinas River. This acreage was to be laid out for business and residential lots for a town to be called Crocker after the president of the Southern Pacific Railroad. The name was later changed to Templeton for Crocker's son. Templeton is the only town on the El Camino Real named for a person other than a saint. Buyers were attracted from everywhere to this area to attend the land auctions. It is reported within 90 days there were three hotels, three general stores, a drugstore, and seven saloons. Two churches were formed, the Presbyterian Church and the Lutheran Church. Both are still holding services in the same buildings today. Since there was no law enforcement agency, the churches helped keep Templeton law-abiding. In 1897, a great fire destroyed most of the downtown area. Since most of the buildings were made of redwood, they burned quickly. Templeton has come back and is bigger and better than ever. Today, this unincorporated community covers all the best attributes for a quick weekend adventure. Templeton is growing and has many amenities to offer. The town is dominated by huge trees. The downtown park with its large gazebo and numerous community activities and is a social gathering place year round. The park is great for picnicking, barbecues, and has two swimming pools and a kids' play area. There are summertime concerts, farmers markets, and other events typically put on by the Templeton Chamber of Commerce. For a full list of the events, please visit the Templeton Chamber of Commerce website. Other activities are found at the arena on North Main Street, where you can watch ropings, sortings, and team pinning year-round by our local horsemen and women in the evening or weekends. There's a youth center and skate park for the local youth to enjoy. There are several wineries in Templeton and dozens nearby. We also have an olive industry that is producing some incredible olive oils and olive byproducts. The Country House Inn is a bed and breakfast furnished with antiques and located in the home C.H. Phillips built for his family in 1886. McVee's Grill is the oldest business building in town that survived the big fire. Now stay tuned as your host Chad Stevens will take you on a journey to visit some of the current merchants of Templeton. Welcome Chad to Helping Hand Health Education. We are an authorized training center for CPR and first aid here in Templeton and we'd like to teach you a little bit about CPR. All right. Thank you, Jackie. We're very happy to be here. We know exactly how important it is for everyone to learn CPR. The CPR classes are very important for people who have swimming pools, people who do a lot of traveling, uh, surfers, people who are do a lot of uh, time at the beach. And uh, we'd like to train more people out there to be, be aware of an emergency if that happens. Well, tell us a little bit more about the CPR classes that you offer. The most frequently taught class in our Heart Saver series is the Heart Saver CPR First Aid and AED class. It is an OSHA class and for safety training, and um, it's a wonderful class. It can include adult, child, and infant CPR, and it also includes defibrillation for automated external defibrillation, or AED. The next class we have is just a... Uh, good old CPR class w that includes AED and can include the infant and children class as well. And then we have a standalone first aid class that has four components of first aid, which is basic first aid, medical emergencies, environmental emergencies, and injury emergencies. Let's talk about something that's very near and dear to both of us, and that's the Heart Saver Pediatric First Aid class. It is very near and dear to us because this is the class that uh, child care providers, coaches, 
camp counselors. This is a California regulation. It is an eight hour class that includes the four disciplines in uh, first aid along with CPR for adult child and infant defibrillation and specialized information such as inhaled medications for asthma. And it's a very, very empowering class. We love it. It's one of our favorite classes that we teach and it does offer a two year certification. Jackie, I know you do a lot of business classes. Who needs to be certified and, and who will that help? Well, um, under the law for the state of California or for uh, Cal OSHA, um, there are certain requirements for certain businesses to take uh, CPR, first aid, and automated external defibrillation classes. They do get to have hands-on training for the automated external defibrillators, and there are many, many businesses here on the Central Coast that actually have defibrillators in their business because of uh, government regulations for that. Now, you also offer classes on-site for businesses. We do. Probably the majority of our businesses that we we work with our on-site training. Uh, a lot of companies prefer to have their training done at their own facility uh, because they have their employees there. A lot of times it's good for us because we get to see the type of business that they are and can again dovetail those requirements into our classes. Okay, we have a great resource right here on the Central Coast. You need to take advantage of it. Helping Hand Health Education. Hi, Jennifer. I'm Chad. Nice to meet Hi, you. Hi, Chad. I'm Karen. Hi, Karen. Chad, I'm Jerry. Jerry, nice to meet nice all to of meet you. you. Well, we're here with the Groves on 41, and Karen, I guess we're going to start with you today. Let's go. All right. First of all, I want to say how gorgeous the grounds are here at the Groves on 41. Thank you. Thank you. Now, tell us a little bit more about what you do. We're uh, farmers, actually. We are living our dream here. We uh, bought the property a few years back and planted 4,000 olive trees. The area is known as a wonderful growing region for some incredibly fresh uh, olive oil. But then we looked around the groves and thought, this is just too pretty not to share. Okay, so that means people can have events out here at the Groves on 41. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. As a matter of fact, uh, we're close to town, yet we're out in the country, and we've got lots of parking. All right. Let's talk about the olive oil. Terrific. That's our passion. The whole area produces some incredible oils, the wonderful Tuscan, the bolder Tuscan varieties. Mm -hmm. uh, we elected to do a mild uh, buttery flavor. We're doing Arbequina. It's a Spanish uh, olive. We've got about 3,500 of those. They're mild oils that'll go with just about anything. All right, we talked about events. Yes. Can people come here and taste the oil? Well, they can. They can by appointment. We don't have a formal tasting room. We invite people to come on out and, and, and take a look, and we've got many different flavors for them to go through. So if they're going to be coming up here and doing some wine tasting, yes, maybe they want to switch gears and try a little bit of the, um, the other fruit here, the olive uh, oil. Excellent. Sounds to me like it'll be fun for the entire family. Oh, it is. It is. It's, it's a wonderful. We've got recipe ideas for kids and contests. It, we make it an awful lot of fun. We play with our food. That's great. <laughs> <laughs> We're here in what they call the barn. It grows on 41 with Jennifer. This is the nicest barn I've ever seen. Well, you know, polished floors, you got to have something nice for weddings and meetings. All right. Now, speaking of weddings and meetings, mm -hmm. we touched a little bit about you guys doing events. I want to hear more about that. So we have so many opportunities where we can do an intimate 20 person farm to table dinner after you go check out the mill. You can also come back for a celebration. Why not throw a birthday party, a wedding anniversary or do your vows and say your I do's and have your wedding here? Wow. So how many people can you accommodate? Anything up to about 120 for a social event, and then we can also do a meeting with classroom style seating for about 60 or so guests. We've got a ton of parking and a beautiful patio outside for lunch. And easy access to get in. Absolutely. 
All right, let's talk a little bit more about the olive oils and the tastings. Mm -hmm. Now, behind us, we've got a table set up yes. with some words that I can't pronounce. <laughs> what, you can't say praline? Oh, I can say praline. <laughs> I can say raspberry, and that's pretty much it. <laughs> we have uh, we have our uh, style trees here, which are the arbequina and the coroniki. So those are the trees that we're growing. We also have some great flavors that come from both of those, and those are lemon and basil, fabulous for cooking, raspberry and praline, excellent with any kind of pound cake, ice cream, dessert, you name it. And we do want to mention once again that all of your olive oils are available to the public. Absolutely. They're available at tastings, when we're at shows, and of course online as well. Well, I'm sorry to say we're finished here at the Groves on 41. I've had a great time and learned a lot about olive oil. Karen, Jerry, Jennifer, thanks for having us out. And if you want to learn more and order online, just go to thegroves'on41.com. The Templeton Chamber of Commerce is proud to sponsor Templeton Welcomes You. Templeton continues to maintain its small town charm along with the dynamic business community which the Chamber continues to enhance. We are home to many fine wineries and olive oil growers. Templeton is fortunate to have the only hospital in the North County and hosts the area's only semi-pro baseball team. Templeton has plenty to see and do along with an amazing performing arts center. So feel free to visit us online or on Facebook, or stop and visit us and stay a while, because Templeton welcomes you. Well, thank you. I'm happy to be here. We are here at Nature's Touch Nursery and Harvest in Templeton. Mm, beautiful because this downtown is Templeton. Exactly. Historic downtown Templeton. Mm -hmm. Now, Melanie, tell me what makes Nature's Touch different from your run-of-the-mill grocery store. Well, what makes Nature's Touch different is, is that we're a seasonal grocery store. We're all about all locally farmed, honest farms. We only support farmers who are farming with honest practices. And it's really easy to make sure that they're farming, honestly, because they're right here. They're right here in California, farming beautiful food. So what is seasonal? It's seasonal to California. So we have the beautiful tomatoes and corn now, where we have the citrus and greens in the wintertime, where you won't see corn on our shelf in the middle of January. So everything is local as much as possible. You know the people that are growing the food. Mm -hmm. You can come in here and purchase that and help out the communities. You got it. We are farm direct. We are farm to food every day. There's not, this is, it doesn't, you can call it an event every day, yes, but it's just something that is standard to us. It's knowing the hand that picked your food. That's, That's what we're about. No question is never not welcomed in here. We can take you from seed to plate with your own food, meaning if you cannot financially buy the food all the time, mm -hmm. but you have maybe a little area, maybe wine barrels, maybe planters, maybe pots, that you have the ability to grow a little bit. We're here to even help you with that too. Wow. And you know what's really fun about our store as well is we take everything from A to Z, meaning we have you know the apples to the zucchini from your produce, but we also are a local meat store as well. Oh. We have all animals that have been raised right here in the San Luis Obispo County. They're processed in our local USDA facility. Mm -hmm. So literally we know from birth to harvest how all these animals have been raised and, har and processed. We have everything from chicken to duck to goose to quail to pork, lamb, beef, goat. Wow. And it continues. Rabbit. Mm -hmm. We also have rabbit that is being raised in San Miguel. It's beautiful. It's literally taking everything that we need to survive within our own food system right here. Okay. Now, you touched a little bit on this early on. Tell us about the seasons and, and what people can expect during the, the seasons as far as your, your harvest goes. Well, let's take it back a step. Okay. Let's talk about your own human body. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we've been experiencing 100 plus degrees in the last couple of days. How did you feel? 
tired, hot, Lethargic, little yes. dehydrated. Mm -hmm. Well, Mother Nature has a really cool way of dealing with that for us. So what becomes ripe during that time? Watermelons, ah. cucumbers, musk melons, zucchini. Why? Because all of those fruits contain the salts, the sugars, and the moistures that your and my body needs to sustain ourselves through that hot weather. So nature's, that is what, nature's way of putting everything back in your body that you need. With a little bit of nature's touch help. <laughs> there you go. That's what we're all about right here in Templeton. Literally, wow. yes. right here. Now, speaking of that, I understand your smoothies are great. And I'd really like to try one, if you don't mind. I, you know, how can you not consider great when you can actually look and pick the fruit that actually goes into your beautiful fruit smoothie. The fun thing about Nature's Touch is that we have a full licensed kitchen inside our store, which is called Nature's Food. Mm. And so what I'm serving you here is, you know, strawberries that were harvested about two weeks ago. And then we picked some beautiful plums. They're the red raven that went into, so that's where you're getting your dark red color. Oh, that's delicious. Boy, you can really tell everything's fresh. It's really good. So. Think about that on those 100, 100 degree days. I will, and now I know where to come back and be refreshed. Exactly. Well, now think of all we've learned in just a few short minutes. We have a local expert here. It is a family feel. You said you've been here for 14 years now. Folks keep coming back. Your customers, return customers, can answer questions for other customers. It really is a big family, and if you have any questions about fresh, homegrown, Honestly farmed. Honestly farmed food, mm -hmm. no matter what it is. Mm -hmm. Here's your expert right here, Melanie Blankenship. Don't forget, Nature's Touch Nursery and Harvest. Give them a call, come down to the shop, or look for their website. Melanie, thank you so much thank for, you for coming. having me here today. Be sure to tune in to Central Coast Now for local television programming on Charter Channel 10 and Comcast Channel 27, where you can experience different cities up and down the Central Coast, in addition to local wine shows, home improvement shows, staycation shows, RV shows, educational shows, and so much more. So support your local businesses by tuning into Central Coast Now or visit centralcoastnow.tv. All programming produced by Noble Productions, your small town and affordable video production company. Contact Valerie at 805-260-4766 for more information. The end of summer is in sight, but don't let that get you down because at Sky River RV, it's time for the summer sell down. The 2014 model RVs are on the way, and a lot of smart RV shoppers have been waiting for this because they know now is the best time to buy a new 2013. And when it comes to trade-ins, bring your car, boat, igloo, whatever you've got of value will be considered. Come to Sky River RV where you'll find the best selection of new and previously owned RVs on the Central Coast. Hello and welcome viewers. I am so excited to be here at Upscale Resale in Templeton. I'm here with Monica and with Tamara. And Tamara, why don't we start by telling the viewers a little bit more about Upscale Resale. Well, Upscale Resale is a women's designer consigner boutique and we carry labels that you can't easily find around here. So it's like shopping in all your most favorite stores at one time. And Monica, if you can tell our viewers how you ladies got started here at Upscale Resale. Well, one day we were talking and we had exchanged how our husbands were sort of nagging us to get a job and neither one of us wanted to work for anyone. So I expressed how I always wanted to have a consignment store. I, we parted ways. Three weeks later, we were open for business. That was nearly five years ago. And today we're in an even better location providing more choices for clothing. We're real careful to not take items that you can find at our big box stores around here. We really want you to feel like you're shopping in all your favorite stores at once, like things from Macy's, Nordstrom, Neiman Marcus, and all your favorite stores. We've got coach purses and Dooney and Burke, Michael Kors. You can find fabulous labels like St. John, and um, our jeans are very high end. We've got Joe's jeans and um, Red Engines, Seven for All Mankind. Um, Citizens of Humanity, Paige Hudson, just really great labels. And uh, you can dress from head to toe and everything in between. 
at up to 90% off retail. Perfect. It's up to 90% off retail. You hear that, everybody? That's huge. For those name brands, I mean, Coach, I mean, those are all things that all of us ladies would love to have in our closets. But the wonderful thing about upscale resale is that our consigners are actually from San Diego all the way up to San Francisco. But even with that, we do carry quite a few items from local artisans, including the beautiful outfit that Tamara's wearing. Wow, and that is very cute. I meant to compliment you on that. Thank That's you. great. So you have anything to add to that? Yes, this is one of my favorites. This is a local mom who designs everything here on the Central Coast, and it's all made here. It's active wear. We have lots of different sizes and six different racks of her items, so there's lots to choose from, and they fly off the shelves. They're really popular. One of the benefits of shopping at Upscale Resale is you're actually helping the local economy. We all love to shop local, but this is how it works. Women come in and they bring us their wonderful clothing. We sell their wonderful clothing. They come in and they get their check. They go down the street, get their nails done, buy a pizza, a bottle of wine, and it's just really good for everyone. Okay, well, we've had so much fun here today. And Tamara, you've got to tell our viewers where they can come visit you, what your hours of operation, what your website address is, and all that good stuff. Great. So Upscale Resale, Women's Designer Consigner Boutique. We are at 590 South Main Street in downtown Templeton next to AJ Spurs. And we also, for your convenience, have Skype. So if you'd like to see anything up close, just Skype in and we'll show it to you. So whether you're 18 or 88 or somewhere in between, we've got something for everybody. Say you saw it here and get a free gift with purchase. You can't beat that. So be sure to come down to Upscale Resell really soon because they've got a lot of great things waiting here for you. The Templeton Chamber of Commerce is proud to sponsor Templeton Welcomes You. Templeton continues to maintain its small town charm along with the dynamic business community which the Chamber continues to enhance. We are home to many fine wineries and olive oil growers. Templeton is fortunate to have the only hospital in the North County and hosts the area's only semi-pro baseball team. Templeton has plenty to see and do, along with an amazing performing arts center. So feel free to visit us online or on Facebook, or stop and visit us and stay a while, because Templeton welcomes you. Noble Productions and Marketing continues to build businesses and communities with great success. Our clientele is extensive and at all levels. We have the ability to market your business at a consultant level or we can represent you as your marketing firm. We provide standard media options and have the ability to build custom campaigns and promotions. At Noble Productions and Marketing, we will accomplish your business goals. Please call us today for a free consultation and like us on Facebook. We're here with Brent Watson at Central Coast Pharmacy Specialist. Brent, happy to be here. Chad, it's a pleasure to have you with us. This Thank morning. you. Now, Central Coast Pharmacy Specialist, that tells me something. You're not just a regular pharmacy, correct? That's correct, Chad. We're not a typical regular pharmacy as most uh, individuals, as most patients might recognize. We, we specialize in medication that has been requested of us to be made by physicians for their patients in particular. So actually, we make medications here as opposed to taking it from a large bottle and counting it out and putting it into a small bottle. So you're sort of a mixologist. If you look back uh, 50, 60 years, that's what pharmacy was all about, the process of taking chemicals off of the shelf and making it specifically for the patient's needs. Now, that's called compounding, is that, that correct? That is called compounding. It would be much like you could uh, uh, compare it to going to Albertsons and get, getting a cake off of, a, off of the shelf there or having one at the bakery made. Uh, what we do is we actually make the cake. We make the cake, we start with the flour, the sugar, the baking powder, whatever you would use, and we come up with a finished product. All right. Now, it's not just for humans that you do prescriptions. You also do uh, veterinary prescriptions also. That's right. We started in about 1991 uh, doing veterinary prescriptions. We began doing them for 
veterinarians all over the state of California. However, as more and more time have gone, has gone by and compounding pharmacies have started uh, to multiply in the state of California, more and more people are doing them. So we're not all over California any longer, but we still have our faithful few out there in California, veterinarians that still do order from us for their patients. So Brent, how did you start doing this and how long have you been doing it? Actually, I'm a graduate of Arroyo Grande High School. Excellent. Uh, my grandchildren who live in Paso Robles are the sixth generation of my family in the county and um, worked for two pharmacists my last year in high school and they convinced me that that's what I needed to become was a pharmacist. So they mentored me through the years. I went to University of Pacific for five years uh, to become a pharmacist and uh, I'm, I'm proud to say that was 40 years ago this last April that I graduated. Wow. So I've been practicing, practicing pharmacy for the last 40 years. All right. Well, you know, doctors practice. Lawyers practice, you know, just we have to keep on top of things. That's basically what we're saying. And you came back here to continue practicing. Right. San Luis Obispo County is home. And Templeton has been home since 1989, having lived most of my life down in the South County and practicing in the South County. I've now eclipsed my South County practice by my North County practice of uh, nearly 25 years now. All right, you'll find them in historic downtown Templeton, Central Coast Pharmacy Specialist Brent. Thank you so much for taking time with us today. Chad, it was certainly our pleasure. Thank you. Thank you. Templeton is an ideal place to stop over on the way to Hearst Castle and a perfect place for friends to meet from Los Angeles and San Francisco. Anyone who lives here will tell you the benefits of living in a town with clean air and the peace and quiet of the country. Our community charm and welcoming atmosphere will be a delightful experience for you and your family, whether you come for a visit or plan to stay. Templeton is one of the Central Coast's best kept secrets. We hope that you've enjoyed visiting Templeton and know that once you've experienced Templeton, you will be back. Templeton welcomes you all year round. The end of summer is in sight, but don't let that get you down because at Sky River RV, it's time for the summer sell down. The 2014 model RVs are on the way and a lot of smart RV shoppers have been waiting for this because they know now is the best time to buy a new 2013. And when it comes to trade-ins, bring your car, boat, igloo, whatever you've got of value will be considered. Come to Sky River RV where you'll find the best selection of new and previously owned RVs on the Central Coast. I'm Melanie Blankenship, and welcome to our new show, Nature's Neighbor, Growing From Our Roots. This show is all about living sustainably here on the central coast of California. We're going to learn about all there is to grow from A to Z, whether it be the apples that we're growing and harvesting in the early fall, or it's the zucchini that we grow and harvest in the beginning of the summer. Nature's Neighbor is a show that is all about what it takes to live within our means sustainably here in our community. Whether it be learning how to raise backyard poultry, whether it be to learn how to build a chicken pen, or how about just to know the true honest source of your local meats. We're also going to bring the health talk into learning how to live within our own means. The true sustainability is learning how to do this in a healthy, simple, honest manner. Join us for conversations about health through food, farming and living through igniting the imagination of our neighbors here on the central coast of California and beyond and creating a more sustainable food and life system. You may want to know what the weather has to do with what I'm eating and how I'm feeling. Why do I want heavy and hearty foods in cooler months and a salad and light foods in the warmer months? Nature's Neighbor is a show that will help you understand how to live by seasons, by what you plant and by what you eat. What does it mean when the word organic is on my package? What does it mean to be sustainable? What does it mean to buy local? Nature's Neighbor is here to help simplify all these labels, questions, and words that are out here in our food culture. We 
hope you will join us on Nature's Neighbor. For scheduling and premiere dates, or if you'd like to submit a topic, or be a guest, go to naturesneighbor.com, or like us on Facebook, or contact Noble Productions and Marketing.